Hello guys, it's Tyler, and like I said, um, I was gonna get the part two of the review of the Avengers 2 movie. Um, yes, uh, be advised, this does contain spoilers, alright? Alright, uh, what was, the, uh, what was the last time I saw the movie? Like three days? See if I can remember what I can. Um, but it was so good, it was hard, it's actually kind of hard to forget, because it was so well. Um... I tell you what, I like the fight scenes where uh, Thor and Captain America are involved. involved. Almost said involved. Uh, they make a good team. Um, Thor and Captain America. They just do some cool shit. Um, what happened in the movie was Thor got his hammer ready. Captain America was holding up his shield. When Thor hit his shield, it made these waves that just like I don't know disintegrates everything in front of it so that was pretty cool the Ultron in this movie is kinda not like the Ultron in the comics in the comics Ultron does not have a mouth that moves he's actually just a whole robot in the comics in this movie he's like a human like robot like kinda looking like having human like qualities like a moving mouth and blinking eyes and everything I thought the vision was pretty cool and the Vision, yeah, I think that he's definitely an Avenger. There were some funny things in the movie, like stuff mostly Iron Man said. <laughs> Iron Man can be funny sometimes, and um, I like the fight scene where uh, Iron Man got his Hulkbuster suit and was fine the Hulk. Now that was a pretty cool fight. Apparently, one thing I did not know was what was going to happen. Uh, Black Widow and the Hulk, uh, well, actually Bruce Banner, uh, not the Hulk, they like each other and they end up becoming a couple. And one cool thing, uh, we find out that Hawkeye has a family and it's it's pretty cool. I wonder who would win, Hawkeye or Bullseye? Because they're both accurate when they throw shit or shoot stuff. Hmm. You know, I wouldn't underestimate Bullseye because, you know, he, he does have a he does have a vertebrae that's coated with adamantium, so I think that has some kind of effect in superheroes if it's in on your spine. Uh, I like the scene with Quicksilver. Quicksilver, yes, was pretty cool. Uh, he kind of pissed me off in the beginning because he wasn't affiliated with the Avengers in the beginning, but then later on he starts teaming up with them. Um, and if you guys didn't know, if you ever, if you if you ever watch Kickass, uh, Kickass is Quicksilver. Um, Jeez, I forgot the name. I, I know he has a long name. So yes, the movie is good. I would recommend you seeing it. It was pretty cool. Uh, my friend said uh, Avengers 1 was a lot better than it. Well, I don't care what they said. Um, I did say 10 out of 10. It'll remain that way. I Guys, I know I say 10 out of 10 and everything, but I can't help it. And my friends are telling me to be honest when I do these reviews. I am being honest. I, I, I don't know how to make myself more clear with these reviews. I mean, it gets what it deserves. Um, they've been suggesting me to call it 9 out of 10 because there were some problems with the movie. Um, I'm trying to figure out what. Um, geez, well, I don't know what they found wrong with it. I mean, everything was good. It's just in my opinion, I like the fight scenes. Uh, most of the villains, they pissed me off. But everything was good. Everything was awesome, and I really would recommend you seeing it. And that is all I'm going to say for tonight, these two videos right here. So I hope you have a nice night, and I hope you will always have a nice night.